What's up everybody, Sour Milk back here. I know it's been a little while since I made a video, but I really don't care. Um, I'm going to be talking about, what's his name, Bryce Hall. He's, a, he's an idiot. He did something really stupid, and now he's like, oh, I can't believe this happened to me. Also, please excuse the fact that I'm absolute dog shit at Phantom Forces on Roblox. Um, this was literally my second time playing it ever, so yeah, hope you enjoy so if you keep up with the YouTube news and stuff, I'm sure eight other YouTubers have already told you about this. Uh, about, I don't know, two weeks ago maybe, FaZe Jarvis, I don't even know why he considers himself a FaZe member, because about half of them, the people who live in the FaZe house, you can't see me, but I'm doing air quotation marks right now, they all do vlogs, yeah. Uh, anyway, he made a video called DMing 100 by YouTubers, it's really creators, uh, ask and asking for a dare. And one of those people that uh, Jarvis DM'd was the famous Addison Rae, who does nothing but shake her ass on camera. I know that shouldn't even be allowed anywhere on the internet, but it is, and the excuse is just TikTok. And so Bryce Hall, I don't really know what he does. He is dating, I am also doing, I'm doing quotation marks again. Any, like, TikTok or social media relationship is not real, it's for business. We saw what happened with Morg and Kira Bridget, and it's happening again with this fake girlfriend. Let's just say that Bryce Hall was not too happy when Jarvis accidentally leaked uh, his girlfriend's number. Alright, keep in mind, this was completely on accident. Like, obviously, he didn't mean to leak her number. Um, I don't think anyone would really do. We'll get back to that, um, because there are some people that will leak some people's number on purpose. So back when this was all happening a few days ago, like this might have actually been a week ago, I'm not sure, um, Bryce Hall, this guy, he, t well, the, the main guy, he tweets out, you're an idiot at Lil Jarvis, which is just such a weak insult, especially when someone accidentally leaked your number, like obviously it was an accident, but if you were to leak their number, I'd say I'd go after them and call them, you soggy piece of garlic bread. And also, by looking by his profile picture, I can see that he, he's an e-boy. He, he's an e-boy with his bare chest out. Yeah, I, those are arguably my least favorite people on the internet, besides the Paul brothers. And so, this is when things get really stupid. I don't know if I already told you this. I probably did. Bryce Hall uploads a video saying, Don't leak my girlfriend's number. I know, it's such a threat. He literally intentionally gives out... Faze Jarvis's number, which, for, for one thing, Jarvis accidentally leaked her number. He he didn't try to do that. He wouldn't, I don't think he would do that. I don't know he could, but it was obviously an, an accident. And then you just go, you, you, you know it's an accident, and you just leak his number. Like, that is such a douchebag thing to do. The fact that this guy has a girlfriend is just beyond me. He's just such an asshole for doing this. You you don't leak someone's number. Like, obviously what Jarvis did was an accident, and he sh probably should have maybe looked it over and redone the shot. But you don't intentionally leak someone's number. And so then, I don't know if this happened a few days later, YouTube actually decided to make a good decision for once, and they took that video down. And yeah, obviously the video should have been taken down. Vlad fucking cyberbullied him, gave away his number. And I'm not even gonna lie, it I don't really know about you guys, but I, f I sort of felt like in this tweet, I'm gonna- It's probably up on screen by now, I don't really know. It honestly seemed like he was complaining a bit. It's like, oh no, I can't put out Vlogmas. It kind of reminded me of like Rice Gum when he was, I don't know what years, it was probably 2017. He's like, oh man, you know, it just really bothers me. Well, it doesn't bother me that I wasn't in Rewind, it's just for you guys, you know, the fans, man. So yeah, um, this entire situation, I don't know if it's gonna evolve even more. Bryce Hall, or Bryce Wall, because he's just about as boring as one. Uh, he said, I'm gonna try not to cyber bully anymore. You, you already know he's gonna do it, he's a TikToker. That's just how things work. I predict these things, I'm like Conor McGregor. Um, who's going, I hope, whoops, Jake Paul's ass. Anyway, yeah, if you want to, if you want to subscribe, feel free to. Um, yeah, I'll make another video soon, hopefully, yeah, peace.